Hello everyone, hope you're all doing good. Uh, in this video, we are going to solve the problem with the Uncharted 4 uh, unsupported CPU. CPU does not meet the minimum specification for running this title. Okay, so why this occurs? Uh, this is because uh, this game requires the ABX2 instruction set which is missing in the Intel's old generation CPUs, uh, specifically the second generation and the third generation. The fourth gen CPU uh, supports this instruction set. If we open the SW info, we can see that the AVX instruction set is available, but AVX2 is missing. Okay, so how can we bypass this? So it's very simple, and there is a tool available on Intel's website. If we head to this link, I will leave this link in the description so you can download it. So uh, just head to the second last one, the Win uh, Microsoft Windows 25 MB and download it. I already have it on my desktop, so I'm not going to download it again. All you have to do is to open this up and select all the content of this folder and create a new folder and put it in there like this. So once we have it, the next thing we are going to do is to create the shortcut of the STE.exe executable on our desktop. Okay, so uh, once we have the shortcut on our desktop, all we are going to do is to go to the properties and in the target section, we are going to put a little command. Uh, just put a little space. Uh, it's mandatory. It's a part of the syntax. So we are going to put a dash minus sign, HSW, and again, space and double dash. This is very, very important. And once again, uh, a little space so we have space here and here and here so this is very important otherwise it will not work okay the next thing is we're going to uh, go to the properties of our game executable and copy the target uh, link uh, command a and command c and we have copied the target link and we're going to paste it right at the last of the space okay so there we have it so let me show you once again like we have the space in the starting and then dash hsw and space again and double dash and then space again and then the uh, directory uh, of our game now I'll simply click ok and we are good to go so now we have we can simply double click this link and our uh, game will start after this uh, black screen appears it will take a little longer but don't worry it will definitely load the game this trick works but it's not the ultimate solution to play the game we have to upgrade to the newer generation so let's see how long it takes to load okay uh, you can visit my YouTube channel and uh, see the gameplay test on this CPU. That, like, I'm not going to like let it load to the end let, because it's going to take a lot of time. So, it is what it is. Let's just wait a little and see how long it takes. okay go to the performance tab okay there we have it this cpu is very capable like it's still doing great in the new titles but just because the lack of this instruction set it's not able to play this game okay so here there we have it hope you enjoyed this video i'm not going to like let it load to the end because it's going to take a lot of time so hope this uh, uh, like work for you and if you enjoyed this video thumbs up and if you're new to this channel subscribe to the channel and i will see you in the next video tata bye bye